Hey, good morning. Dr. Fabian Garcia here, owner of Fabian Garcia of Physical Therapy, along with Marissa Tio, my assistant, and also FRC Mobility Specialist. So the next one out of the morning series that we're going to go to is the lumbar or the lumbar pelvic circle. Now Marissa's going to turn around for me, and what she's going to do is that she's going to put her hand on the base of her sacrum right there, because she's going to be moving her sacrum with intention. So what's nice about this hand position right here is that when you place hands on someone, whether it's my hand or her hands on herself, that hand is inducing an external stimulus to which the central nervous system will react very, very quickly to. Remember, the central nervous system is very plastic, very fluid. It has the ability to quickly adapt to different external stimuluses. So we have to take advantage that if we're learning this motion and we want to drive this motion, she is putting her hands to educate the awareness of where her sacrum and lumbar vertebrae are in space and give a higher quality information to the central nervous system in the brain. So while she's doing that motion here, you're gonna get a two full angle with me doing in the front with my hands placed right here, okay? So now what she's going to do is that she's gonna to commit to going to the right side first, the right hip, and she's gonna go from this three o'clock position down to six, up to nine, four to 12, and as she goes forward into the 12 region, her hands are assisting her lumbar extension. So what she's actually doing is that she's actually helping and facilitating lumbar extension, which is what we tend to lose first, and driving it forward off this position. She's gonna complete two counterclockwise then two clockwise as we go over to different benefits. Now there's gonna be a natural rolling of the femur within the pelvis to lubricate actually the largest joint of the human body, which is your hip joint, your hip capsule. Now, the only way to ensure that is, look how wonderful and heavy her feet are. Even though she weighs a buck 10, the most important thing is that her feet have to be like if she weighs 200 pounds like I do. Her feet cannot shift off to the side and her knees can either have the option of being slightly bent or straight, which is a little bit more advanced because then you're stretching out the nerve a little bit more. <clears throat> Remember what we're doing. We're stretching out all the tissue that is within this region. So we're stretching out the sciatic nerve, SI joint, dorsal sacral ligaments, lumbar vertebrae, fascia, thoracolumbar uh, fascia. We're also stretching out lower intestine as well, great for promoting gut health, digestive health as well. And she's going to stop, and that was flawless. Slow, deliberate, with intention. Intention is facilitated by hand placement right there. Thank you very much for your time.